Um, you pity Walner because <laughs> the main character, um, played by Charlie, is portrayed. Um, you almost feel sorry for him in the situation that he's got himself in or has been put in. Um, <laughs> no, come on, carry on. Um, the, the use of camera angles have made him look smaller and sort of intimidated. So he's sort of, it makes him look like he's stuck and um, he doesn't really know how to get out of the situation he's in. Okay, yeah. Jess. Okay. Bit of a bitch. Oh, that would be good. That would be called animosity. Oh, Anim okay. Animosity towards Jess. Oh, brilliant. Yes. Because she's the one who's caused Warner all this heartbreak. Okay. okay. Yep. Okay. Uh, well, you you feel sympathetic for, to be honest, all parties involved. You feel mm -hmm. sorry for Charlie. He looks depressed. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, at the end where Jessie's is behind the door. Yeah. She looks she looks like it's taking that out of, it taking it out of her as well. Yeah. And to be honest, you feel sorry for the kid yeah. when she walks out the door and she's beaming. Mm. And everyone else is so sad. You just, you are, she's so innocent in yeah. this sort of uh, this story, and it, it's it's they're sad mm -hmm. to see that. Mm -hmm. Sad, emotionally connected to the, a child. I feel sorry for him. Yeah, so give you have to give his kid over to the other dad. Yeah. Trade his kid. For <laughs> that. <laughs> uh, yes, Warner again, because you've gone through a day with him. Okay. I don't know, I feel like I've got some uh, in some in connection with the guy who then goes out with the girl after the guy. Uh, player, like would I. you like to elaborate on that? <laughs> he's a bit of player. Oh, he's a bit of a player, okay. Um. <laughs> yeah, you definitely, you definitely sort of understand what, what Charlie sort of was happening to. Yeah. You see, you know, we've seen this all before, yeah. you know, in TV and people yeah. around you, you see relationships break up and you feel sorry for yeah. pretty much everyone in there. I think again with the main character because the way that he's portrayed you feel sorry for him and you almost feel like you should have or back his side of the story. Would you like to elaborate on the Millwall comment? Uh, Perhaps there's a sort of stoma uh, surrounding being a Millwall fan. Yeah, Okay. Working. Working class. Purely because of where he is, it doesn't even look nice. I mean, he looks like he's sort of... He doesn't look sort of real working class. Yeah. But he's sort of in the, in the in that gap. Yeah. Uh, yeah. It's not, you know, he doesn't look like a proper... What I would... As a chat. Yeah, as such. yeah, yeah. But he, you know, he doesn't look like middle class yeah. and that. Yeah, sort yeah. of somewhere in the middle. Alright. Um, I think that he's sort of stuck in the working class sort of background, maybe growing up in an estate with, um, surrounded by maybe gang life or culture from that sort of um, area, mm -hmm. and um, he's almost stuck and he can't find a way out. I don't know. Like, like, I'm a bit. He's probably, he's probably I don't like, know. I didn't even know. Probably like. Rap, soul slash grime. You'll have a uh, definite answer. Collaborate. Collaborate in soul and grime. Okay. <laughs> After just listening to you, unaware? No, I wouldn't, I wouldn't be able to. I don't know. I don't even, I can't even think of a genre. <laughs> <laughs> right. I'm thinking, I'm trying. Um, to be honest, it's not my sort of, not my sort of tune. But, yeah. um, you know, sort of, that like rap, almost well, like rap, yeah. Like where they're talking about those issues, yeah, and, yeah. You know the the drugs and the drink and the relationships mm -hmm. and stuff like that. Um, I couldn't put it into one. You could have put it into one. No. Is there a reason for that? No. Um, so you have to there's not sort of one particular one, but they um, artists that sort of sing or um, rap about sort of issues which you find that are very low in society rather than sort of the, the upper class um, people is sort of from the estates of drugs, drink and stuff like that is artists that sing about that um, I find this relates more closely to.
Do I don't know. You don't know, okay. Angel. Yeah, it's, again, it's not really my area. Forte. So, um, <laughs> yeah. Uh, I couldn't name okay. any artists, yeah. but sort of, you know, that sort of... Like someone, someone, someone maybe like Eminem, not that kind no, of yeah, music, yeah. but that that kind of guy from he's that talking, area. Yeah, he's talking about like violence. Yeah, the hardships. Yeah, yeah. for any like artist name. Yeah. Stephen Muggs. Good. Um, maybe like any any British rap sort of. Who's that for me? Who's someone? Oh, oh, Tyler. <laughs> <laughs> someone like Stormzy, I'd say. Oh, okay. Like, yeah. Cool. yeah. Um. You can relate to Warner being the main character because of the background that he's come from. Okay. Uh, any of the emotions or like scenarios that the characters are in? Yeah, because he's young. Um, personally, no. Okay. Because I haven't got a job. <laughs> Fair enough. Uh, what about later on in life? Do you feel like this is the sort of thing that you may come up against or maybe relevant to other people? Yeah. Can you see how this is relevant? I feel, I think that if um, being in this situation, the way that the whole story is conveyed, um, it seems like an, an accurate representation of the emotions that everyone will be feeling in, in that circumstance, um, in terms of the, the child and the two and the two parents. Uh, not really. I don't feel like I'm old enough to have gone through any of the traumas he got there. Yeah. Being a Millwall fan, I can probably relate to some of that. Um, I mean. Personally, no. I've never been in that situation. Yep. But you know, you 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 can see, you you, you see the emotion, and you yeah. see this everywhere. Mm -hmm. You know, relationships break down. Yeah. It's on TV. It's in the media. It's in, you know, it's everywhere. Yeah. You can totally understand what's going on. No, I feel like I feel like some of some of the actors. I won't name names, but they look about twelve. Could you name names, please? <laughs> what could you specify? Like the, dad, the, the, the guy. The dad who had to he looked too young. He looks too young. Okay. And also the girl who looked too young. She had spots on her face. Doesn't look old enough to be a father. He was. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. In the way that Warner looks, if that's a bit of an insult to him, I'm no, sorry. No, no, no. So yeah. would you say it's more of his like physical status? So he, so he looks quite like yeah. fragile sort of thing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think all the um, actors and actresses suited every role that there was, um, and that was it was well thought out and it conveyed the story much e much better and easy for sort of me to understand and relate to. Holly looks a bit young mm -hmm. to be to have a kid. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> and, yeah. yeah, yeah. You know, um, that's the only thing. I mean, Charlie looks hard. Yeah, that's or, you know that's Charlie's thing. But yeah, he's a bit young. Yeah. That's, no, I agree. But you know, you can't really do anything. Yeah. Like, um, he was quite <clears throat> successful invoking sympathy because, like, you felt sorry for him, like, getting to that point. I feel like as the video develops, you get a build up, and then the end is like, wow, I feel, probably feel sorry for him. It's, um, it's very. The colours. Yeah. The colour scheme is very dull. Dull, yeah. Very gray, it's almost grayscale. Yeah, yeah. And that's. He's wearing black mm -hmm. all the time, and that's just. It brings you down. Yeah. It makes you. It makes you sad. And mm. um, yeah, it's, it's just. It's just. Well, it's well because it's slow. Yeah. And the colours are dull. Yeah. And it's. It just depresses you. Yeah. No. Yeah. That, yeah. Uh, yeah. So what reasons? What? What? What is it that caused you to feel pity towards him? Because it seems like he has no one. Because he's mainly by himself most of the time. Okay. Um, mainly sort of the 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 lighting and the camera angles used because um, it was sort of. It pictured him as being very small and lonely, mm -hmm. um, whereas in contrast, almost the, the the kid was oblivious to everything that was going on. So from his perspective, um, it would be quite a lonely place to be in. Okay. Not um, really. It was um, it was well thought. It was quite. There was a lot of sort of simple minimalist ideas that were very effective. Um, so I think maybe if there was. Clever transactions or something like that. Like transitions. Transactions. <laughs> transitions. <laughs> transitions. Yeah. Um, that it may have made it a bit more interesting, but I think because the genre that it was chosen, the minimalist um, idea and concept worked worked very well. Okay. I didn't like it when he mouthed the lyrics. I think that just kind of took away from the story a bit. So you didn't like the performance? Because I was confused whether it was a music video or a story. Ah, oh, okay. Like a kind of music video where they sing. Okay. Out. I was unsure. When he was drinking in front of the kid, uh -huh. that was a bit of a. 
Do you feel like that it's would... It's a bit dubious. Yeah, do you feel like that would take a, take perhaps some of the sympathy that you already had away? Possibly, because it, I mean, you know, you can see he has sort of love for the kid. But yeah. But at the same time, he's he's drinking vodka while, like, yeah. while he's... While he's in response. Yeah, that's a bit... Yeah? A, mm, okay. On the line. I would buy the album, because the digipack does look quite... Was it, did you look, it looks, the if I saw it on the shelves, I'd be like, oh no, this is not a good album. Yeah, and what about after watching the video? Do you feel like the video would entice you even more? Uh, I think if I got more videos with the album, I think if I was just based on the song, I'd, I'd want to hit. I'd, I'd want to see a couple more videos. But you would, videos. but you would be well, interested. You'd be yeah, interested. Be interested. In I would like to see another video. Yeah. Yeah, I think the the way the the video was sort of has been made and it's, it's sort of closely linked to the digipack it sort of gives me a sense that the whole album is based and very similar to the same sort of um, issues and um, the sort of same quality of song so from that perspective I, I probably would buy it and recommend as well to other people I would watch it again Would you be intrigued into listening to more of this kind of music or? Uh. I guess because it has a certain mood to it. What, what kind of mood? Gloomy. Gloomy. Uh, from the, on the basis of that video, um, obviously this isn't my sort of thing. Yeah. But um, yeah, I mean, it's a it's a well constructed video. Um, the digipack's uh, you know it's clean, it's mm. nice, it's, it advertises yeah. the, you know the streets and yeah I don't I would I wouldn't have no problem buying that album. Alright, uh, that's it. Thank you. Cheers, Joey. Thanks, mate.